Hello, my name is Abe. Welcome back to the Binding of Isaac Repentance. It's Isaac time. It's random B-side time. We just, wait, why is my win streak zero? Did I pick the wrong, no, I picked the right save file. I thought we won the last run, but now that I think about it, that was probably the run in which we were, um, this is not a lucky penny. That was probably the run in which we were the, um, Tainted Jacob and we died to Mega Satan after defeating the lamb? Because I'm I'm dumb and I walked into Esau? I don't know, I don't remember. These runs, they all kind of blur together at some point. This is a golden horseshoe, but it's not a golden golden horseshoe, it's just a golden horseshoe. I walked into that enemy who was stationary. We're playing as Tainted Cain. We have the bag of crafting, we're gonna pick up consumables, put them in our bag, and then eventually, you know, have some items that are worth a damn. For now, we'll pick up the pennies, let the pounds take care of themselves. Reminder, this is Repentance Update Tainted Cane, which means that the recipes are random except for special recipes, like eight bombs is a special recipe that, get, well, eight um, mega bombs gives you Mama Mega, and then eight bombs gives you like pyro or stuff like that, so. There are definite special recipes, but I'm looking for whatever I can get. I'm looking for the HP, I'm looking for the keys and bombs, I'm looking to see if we can get some HP upgrades out of the bag of crafting. Maybe we can pick up like, you know, a damage upgrade, a tier upgrade, and then I can just copy and paste that for like the rest of the run. I'm glad actually that this is not gonna be a cube of meat because, you know, oh God! I uh, would prefer to have something else. And I can make my own items. There's always a few recipes that I'm I'm hopeful to make, like, uh, you know, any sort of a tears up, of course, but also something like the halo would be amazing. I, usually that requires one uh, eternal heart. I, I actually don't know if the halo still exists in uh, boss item pools, because Mega Mush used to, not Mega Mush, but Magic Mushroom, used to exist in the boss room item pools, but then they, they changed it, they removed it, so I, I honestly don't know what's in the boss item pools anymore. Pick this up. Let's see what eight pennies gives us. Portable slot, as expected. I gotta sneeze. Pardon moi? What about... One red heart. Little hush. That is not a good item. What about one red heart and one key? A range up. What about one red heart, one key, and one bomb? Maggie's bow? That's incredible. Okay, well we have our new recipe that we're gonna be looking for. A red heart, a key, a bomb, and a whole bunch of pennies. Five pennies to be exact. Yeah, that's a good item. That's fantastic. If we can get that, we'll, we'll be happy. We can get a lot of HP very quickly on this run. So one red heart, one bomb, and one key. And we have to we have to remember that recipe now because you know that recipe is unique to our current game seed Q S K V J G C Z. You're not going to have the same recipe. You, you'll probably have the portable slot recipe, but other than that, no. We need to be aware that that's what's gonna happen. So let's see, let's um put two pills into our bag and see what we get out of this. We gotta go pick up the one penny way back yonder. We're not gonna be worrying about any sort of boss rush on this one, okay? This is not a boss rush run, this is a scrape together some sort of a winning run with the resources that you have available and just pray for the best, okay? Steam sale, that's really good. Two pills? I'm buying that, That like, or I'm, I'm like creating the steam sale. Because if we get restock, if we somehow manage to find restock, we could get infinite items out of the shop by just buying more steam, like creating, I should say, more steam sales over and over again. So that is an option, okay, I like it. And if we had seven cents, we could even buy the uh, the pills, but we don't have the money for it right now. 
Do Steam sales stack? They do. I'm picking up the golden penny in the bag. Uh, Steam sales do stack, but they stack uh, like exponentially. Like the first Steam sale is 50% off, the second Steam sale is 75% off, the third Steam sale is 87 point something percent off. So they don't, two of them don't make items free. You always have to pay for items, but they get cheaper and cheaper and cheaper and cheaper and cheaper exponentially. So we want, wait, this, the third one is one third, or is 66% off instead of 75% off? Well, you know, wh whatever the case may be, more is always better. Hey, Baba loves you, welcome to the stream. So we got a free item out of this. Let's put some pennies in and see what we get. Bob's Curse. King Baby. Dude, King Baby, if we make familiars, that's really good. I'm, I'm actually gonna keep King Baby. And we're, we're never gonna remember the recipe for it, so I'm not, I, I'm not caring about it, but familiars are usually garbage. With King Baby, they're really good. So now I would be very happy to have familiars show up in recipes. I'm like, how do I, how do I cheese this the most? Because I really don't want to have to legitimately fight these things. They're kind of horrifying and horrible. And I want to get my deal with the angel as soon as possible. We got a pill. Let's um, let's leave consumables on the ground because I would love to get another HP upgrade. Maggie's bow. One red heart, one bomb, one key. Ice baby caper. I remember the great ice baby caper, says Milt Thompson. Yeah, back when uh, the recipes were a little bit easier, you could just get a whole bunch of uh, ice, ice babies. Dun, 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 dun. But uh, it's a little bit harder now that the recipes are all random. But if we do get a cheap ice baby recipe, we'll keep it in mind. I will say it's really hard to actually make a good cane run right now because the fact that all of the items are, are kind of randomized uh, with their recipes makes it really hard to find good item recipes because in order to guarantee the good items, you have to put a lot of good items into one bag, which is just freaking impossible. <laughs> it's so hard to do. But here we have Rotten Heart, Red Hearts, a key, Let's put the pill in the bag. Um, and I'm doing this because, you know, I, I didn't want to walk to the curse room again. I'm just picking stuff up. Mom's bottle of pills. Well, two pills was a steam sale. So if we take mom's bottle of pills with us, we can actually start stacking up steam sales. Um. How much Hellstone will I need to make full Hellstone gears? That's totally not a big shot. You just love playing Terraria and watching the stream, don't you? I mean, I can't really blame you. It's a good game. I play Factorio when I watch, you know, people play video games. Like this is Google says mud. All right, I'm gonna I'm gonna take Mom's bottle of pills. You know, let's take it early and then maybe start stockpiling some some pills. Two pills and six cents is a steam sale, and then we can start going to shops and getting stuff on the cheap. In theory, this will pay for itself over a long enough run. Okay, I mean, I do wish King Baby would help me out in a situation like this, though. He's literally not even doing any contact damage. Fantastic. I have to remember, I do have the sack. Look at that throw. Did you see that throw? That, oh, did you see that bomb? Best bomb. Blah, blah, blah. I actually kind of want the HP, but let's fight Ragman. I don't have any more bombs, Ragman, so it's just me and you this time, buddy. If we uh, do get the deal with the devil, we're gonna go for deals with the angel. Um, but let's see what happens, because we might not get the deal. It's only 36% since we took a hit. 
do hate that there's like six spiders running around. Oh good, you made another one. Ragman sucks. He sucks if you have no damage <laughs> and he just gets out of control. Okay, that was that was the last fake spider. Yeah, we didn't get anything out of it, that's fine. There's a lot of money on the ground. This is actually enough for an HP upgrade, so we're gonna go for the HP upgrade here. Two, three, we need two more pennies, and then we need one key. So there's our key, there's our Maggie's bow. Thank you, we look very pretty now. And uh, for the rest of our cash, you know, I'll, I'll pick some bombs and then we will uh, put everything else in the bag and see what we get. We'll just randomly grab bag this one because that's all we can do. And in fact, let's put the pill in here too. Actually, well, I don't know. Maybe we should save the, p the pill and then if we actually get the ability to, to turn it into something else we can, the uh, steam sale. Oh good, <laughs> kamikaze. Pageant boy, this just makes money spawn. Uh, hold on, I'm, I'm gonna put the pill in the in this one. I wanna I wanna see what it gives me. I think I overwrote something. I shouldn't have. I overwrote the card. What is a uh, what does this give? I don't even know what this is. Is this a damage upgrade? Damage plus range up. It's a pill and a bomb and some of my shots get range and damage up. Okay, so if I get a pill and a bomb, I can get some sort of a damage upgrade. It's not the worst, you know? It's not great, but I'll, I'll take it for now, probably. All right, where is our secret room? Probably left or right. There you go. Oh my God. Let's um. What what's what's one bomb? Let, let's learn something. One bomb is glass cannon. Okay. What about a bomb and a nickel? Deep pockets. We have to we have to take this. That's so good. So we'll get more money over the course of the run, which means that more opportunities for uh, good items. And um, in particular with deep pockets, sometimes you get like three dimes spawn in one room. We gotta, we gotta take it, it's so good. Every room will now drop some consumable. That's absolutely worth it. I think, anyways. Yeah, we have steam sale, deep pockets. We're actually building towards an interesting run here. I still don't understand the range up, but you know, as long as it is a range up, I guess I'm happy. I walked into you, but I think we're gonna have to do this run without any sort of a, uh, without any sort of a um, deal with the angel helper or something, because we are we are taking damage every floor. Granted, there wasn't a, uh, a spirit heart that spawned earlier, but I decided not to not to pick it up. Angry Fly. I, I think we can do better than Angry Fly. Although, you know, fly items to get Beelzebub uh, could actually be kind of interesting. You got three of those time waster pennies yesterday, right? Ask for Dracula. Yes, I did get three golden pennies at one point. Out of uh, out of deep pockets, because what what deep pockets? How it works is it spawns internally one penny and then pays it out three times, or up to three times. So it, it spawned a golden penny, but then it copied it three times. So you always get the same type of penny out of it, which is very interesting. Okay, dump the pill. Put the pill in the bag. Metronome, no thank you. Luckfoot, good pills. Yo, we have to take it. Um, What's the button for it? Alt? Yeah, alt is my alt is my alternative uh, Q button, just so that I can use it while I'm dodging WASD. It's a little awkward on the fingers, but I think it's a good compromise. So now we have, we gotta pick these up. Now we have good, uh, good pills. So we can just use the pills out of the, 
the mom's bottle of pills, which honestly we should probably do because it's hard to get stat upgrades. And if I can get tears ups out of the, the pills or HP, then I can spend the consumables not worrying about tears in, in HP ups and, and whatnot. They're gonna blow up. Yeah, that's a, that's a lot of like poo gas. That's a lot of poo gas. Stop poo gassing all over the place. Got him, ladies and gentlemen. This is also the the second floor, so if we want to do the mirror realm, we can. But I'm kind of scared of the mirror realm because our damage is uh, poor. Although on that Maggie run we did yesterday, uh, our damage was poor for like nearly the whole run. This is floor three, so it's not really that bad, is it? And hey, we have one damage upgrade out of one of our, well, we only have one eye, but we have one damage upgrade that applies sometimes. Man, this sucks. I really wish I had a, uh, a bomb. I hope we don't die on this fight. We've done no damage to the boss as of yet. This is this is this is horrendous. <laughs> I should have saved the bomb instead of going to the freaking secret room. King baby, please do something. We actually have quite a few items right now. It's just none of the items that we've we've picked up have been damage items. I wanted King Baby to help, but we haven't gotten any other familiar recipes. We died, apparently we died. I had no idea what my health was at. I'm extremely disappointed, I apologize. I, you know, lesson learned, like save a couple of bombs for the boss fights. That's my, my mistake there. I, I just had no damage. That fight, and, and it's also a, a difficult arena because your shots keep getting blocked. At least on Duke of Flies, most of the time you can land shots. Most of the times you can you can hit something, but half of my shots were just hitting rocks. So I wasn't I wasn't accomplishing anything really on that fight. That was a that's a tough fight. That is a tough fight. Well, lesson learned. Save a couple of bombs for the bosses because after the the basement, if you don't have damage, you are you are in for a rough time. Okay, we'll start over. Now we won't have access to Maggie's bow recipe. Why? Oh my God, our HP is low. Uh, we won't have access to Maggie's bow recipe, but we're gonna have to find a different recipe to uh, to keep us going through the early game here. Starting with two HP is a little rough. <sighs> this is this is where Isaac is uh, is slightly frustrating at the beginning of a game, at the beginning of any run when you have like no damage. Okay, just pick up the HP. These rooms that have. Uh, significant numbers of enemies, and especially like bosses like uh, that guy that we just fought who has the ability to summon annoying enemies. Those are always annoying fights. I didn't mean to pick that up. All right, well, speed up. One spirit heart and three bombs. I'm not gonna take the recipe. I'm going to try and get a better recipe out of this because it's a spirit heart and three bombs, and I don't want to waste the materials just for a speed upgrade. Speed does not matter. Like, we, we have 1.3 speed. Speed was not going to save us fighting those uh, water worms either. We need something else. We need damage, tears, something that gives us more consumables, even though that was like the only thing that we had on the last run and it wasn't good enough because, you know, a ton of consumables. So, what about this? Poke Go? Still don't think it's good enough. Maybe if I does BFF work with Poke Go? I don't know. What is this? Swarm. No, it's a it's a one bomb and a spirit heart for a, an attack fly. You know what? It's freaking damage. You know, it, it's not much, 
but it's honest work, and if we get two more of these, we can have flight. So, one bomb and one spirit heart gives us a flight item. Well, really, two bombs, two spirit hearts, and like, 12 cents, but we'll work on it. Is this the fly that only comes out after you get hit? No, it's not. It's always out, but why is it white? I don't know. Okay. That's a lucky penny, so this will be an interesting item combination. Also, that's the floor, <laughs> so let's go. <laughs> it gives a, gives a viz though. Yeah, if it gives, um, you know, a brimstone familiar Poke Go could be pretty decent, but for the most part, I think it's a little slow. Because if it, the thing about it is that if it doesn't give us anything, then it has no use on a on a boss fight. Spider bite. Goat head. Goat head is pretty good. We only need one, so who cares about what the recipe was? So now, if we take damage, we're fine, and we can get a deal with the angel on the second floor. So, guaranteed, we'll get at least a deal with the angel at some point. So that's pretty decent. Because deal with the angel is free items and free consumables. I don't want to pay for a deal with the devil because we have to pay for it, and we don't even get the item. We just get a black heart and some bombs and keys. That's not good enough. This is definitely an interesting start. Our future is bright, but our present is, uh, let's just say rough. McGruff. Come on, pick up the key. I also need some HP. But honestly, having the fly helps so much. <laughs> it really does feel a lot better. I, I still don't even know what the other uh, item we had on that run was. Damage up, range up. Does it stack? Like, what is it? Well, how much of a damage upgrade? It, it feels like it's kind of like a... Um... I'm trying to remember the name of the item, too. It's kind of like a um, blood clot, is what it feels like. Because that's kind of ambiguous. It, it's hard to tell exactly how much of an upgrade it is. Also, I'm just realizing something. I may have miss. I may. I may have uh, not used the. Yeah, let's see what it is. I may have not used the bottle of pills on that fight, or I may have put the pill in a recipe. I, I can't quite remember. We need the HP. Put everything else in the bag. Pandora's box gives us. Spirit hearts, or consumables, or an item? Look, I know the item is called Sty. I still don't know what it does. <laughs> it's an ambiguous upgrade of, of stats. Samson's Chain. You know what? Uh, there's a Tinted Rock right here. Let's take Samson's Chain, and now we can open stuff. Generally not an item that, that is fantastic, but it also does block enemy shots, and it does damage. So, I think Samson's Chain, th there are worse items, and it gives us something immediately that maybe we can use on this boss fight. And you know what? Pick up a bomb, in case you need it. Guaranteed deal with the devil. We're not gonna go in, we're gonna try to get deals with the angel on the next floor. I wish I could hold the pentagram, but unfortunately not. Let's pick up everything else, except for the key. Fine, and we're gonna go down to the alt floor again. Hopefully this time though it'll be a little bit, uh, hopefully it'll just be better. Right, right, right. Pop these, pop the pots, pop the skulls. You get Swallowed Penny, and now you have a possibility of going infinite if you find the right items to go along with it. There you go, you know, that gives a, you know, X percent better chance of winning the game right there. This is, um, probably a little, 
risky. But I want to come in here anyways just to look around. And we, we have enough pennies outside that we can create an item. So, penny, penny. Peeper's eye, no. Magician, judgment. We're, uh, we're gonna put these in the recipe, see what we get. Oh good, Sty, get out of here. I don't wanna see you ever again. Now, Gimpy. I am gonna take me a Gimpy. That was not smart. <laughs> we have half of a HP, all right. Let's, um, let's be a little bit, what? Let's be a little bit scared now. I wonder what one key gives us on this run. No, 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 run. Please be an HP upgrade. Isaac's heart. Okay, um, not really what I was thinking. <laughs> Good old Isaac's heart. We could look for our crawl space, but that would take too long. Feels like there's a secret room there, but it doesn't make sense why it would be there. We have an extra key. Okay, more consumables. We'll try two keys. Range and luck up. How about two keys and a nickel? Unicorn horn. Honestly, just so, I, just so we have an active item, I'll take it. We can always um, launder this into other consumables just by replacing it in the future, but maybe now we'll have a you know chance of living. 100% deal with the angel chance. All we have to do is live. Live, damn it, live. Okay, well, I mean. We'll look. Mud says, Sty is plus 28% damage in the right eye, plus seven range on the same eye, lower shot speed in the same eye. So 20, 28% damage on the right eye. Interesting. Well, thank you for looking that up, Mud. I, I do appreciate it, because I had no idea. <gasps> it's HP! How did you miss, is the real question. Okay. Fly doing a good job. Thank you very much, Fly. Put the, no, we need a key. We gotta pick up this key. We might wanna pick up a bomb so we can get those fires too. I was thinking we didn't need any bombs. What the heck? Right, his hitbox is, is not there. Um, I was thinking we wouldn't need bombs, but I guess for fires we might want the bombs. Please HP. <laughs> Let me guess. Yep, slots. Well, let's just not get hit, shall we? Wormwood is not that bad. He says right before he dies to Wormwood, possibly. We could either get through the first phase or hold the unicorn horn for the second phase. And I think at this point I'm just holding it for the second phase. Which is not yet here, which is not yet here which is here. I think we, we're hitting him with Samson's chain. Got him. Okay, we're gonna live. <laughs> okay, there, there's a hole there. Okay, I was scared. I was like, I can't access it. Okay, what is one spirit heart? Butt bombs. Turn the Lost for Holy Mantle in flight since they're already at one HP. That's a good point, Nambi. Didn't think about it. It's another fly. Spirit Heart Bomb. Are, are we just gonna turn this into a solar system challenge at this point? <laughs> we could. 
Don't aggro the angel and get yourself killed. Don't get yourself killed. Glitter bombs. Meat. Just for the HP and the damage, I'm taking meat. So sue me. Okay, well we lived. I guess we didn't have to do the angel immediately. We could have just gone somewhere else. Okay, things are looking up. We made it through the, the, the great filter of this run, I think. We actually have health and a damage upgrade now, even though it is a small one. We have flies and we have invincibility, which means we can use our flies for additional damage. So we're, we're kind of building into some sort of an orbital run. I would love it if we could get Unicorn Stump. But we'll work on that one, we'll work on that one. Watch him somehow Samson's chain the mirror on entering. I hope that's not actually a thing, because if that's a thing, that is awful. Oh, it's so good, it's so good having the damage. Two flies, much better than one, just saying. This time, we'll pick it up. We gotta, we gotta strike a bit of a balance. Okay, well, I mean, it doesn't matter. That's a dime. Let's start with cheap stuff. Two bombs and two hearts. It's a steam sail. Look, I, you know, I think I made a mistake last time taking the steam sail. I don't think we need it. Boomerang we don't need. The portable slot we don't need. All right, well. I could have also taken the bombs and blown open the door here, but. Lunch, so that's just HP. HP is nice, is it worth a dime? I don't know, maybe. Please leave, thank you. We're not done with the floor though. Let's see what else we can get from this. Don't mirror, don't chain the mirror. Don't mirror the chain. Let's go fight the boss. I know that we can use it here and still use it later. I'm gonna take it. It gave us all important stats up. So that's a very good experimental treatment. Now, as for the recipe, I don't know. It doesn't matter. Because I'm... It also gave us HP, which is nice. Uh, it doesn't really matter because I'm, you know, probably not gonna take more than one. What was, what was the fly recipe? One spirit heart, one bomb. What, what, what was two bombs, two red hearts? Wasn't that something a minute ago? Oh my god, I'm, oh no, I wanna pick it up. Honestly, I don't remember. Okay, one red heart, one key. More options. This one's interesting um, because we can get more options, which might mean we can put more things in our bag or maybe just open up chests which can give us more consumables. So right now, I'm like, okay, let's open the chest, which did get rid of the penny, but it gave us a different consumable in its place, which might have been worth a little bit more. All right, interesting. There's definitely something there that we can do. Floor. Hello, thank you, come again. Really wish I could just take that. Well, there's a, a bomb and a spirit heart if we wanna try to go for that recipe again, but let's just put everything in the bag and see what we get. Spider Babby. You know, honestly, I think um, items, uh, that's actually the one where when you get hit you spawn flies or spiders, isn't it? Honestly, I think items like this are actually pretty good because items like this can give us 
synergies and transformations. Like, I want to be the fly, I want to be the spider, I want to have flight, I want to be able to make... That's a super tinted rock, by the way. I found it, finally. I want to make good stuff happen. That's an amazing rock. By the way, Tree Jam, welcome to the stream. How you doing today? Okay, now just give me... Right, that was more options. That was not two drops. Give me five more spirit hearts, please. Give me a key and a penny. I mean, we're here, I might as well pick it up. I'm just doing rooms just to have more items. Um, I guess we'll pick up the... Key, because it is worth more than one penny. Oh god, it's an explosive rock. Scared the crap out of me. Now that I uh, recognize or re-remember what those super t super tinted rocks look like, maybe I'll be able to identify them more frequently because I kind of forgot what they look like. It's a very subtle X on that rock. Doc, my power. Thank you for the resub. Yo! And hello. And hello! Anything good? Anything good? Anything good? Anything good? Nope. Alright, what is, what is this? PhD, better pills. Blank card, very interesting. Start here. Red candle. Straw. Decap. Backpack. I know we're um, kind of wasting charges here, but I am like I'm, I'm looking for specific items. I'm looking for good items right now. We're on the caves too. We got to start building power, which we're not really building yet. Yes, parasitoid. We can fly, we're Beelzebub. This is what I wanted! It's It was a different item combination, but it, it got the job done, now we can fly. And we also have Parasitoid, so we are getting flies and spiders, and I think, I think there's another effect to it, but I kind of forgot what it was. I think it's something related to um, flies being friendly to us, but that doesn't make sense. That, that's, that feels too strong. Why are the rocks with bombs in them? They're just there to be annoying, JMC. They're just there to be a, a obstacle and to get you to hurt yourself accidentally at times. Telescope. Interesting. Wheel of Fortune, it's a big ol' re-roll. Aidboard an animal, what kind of an animal do you think he would be? Beagle, bird, polar bear? Polar bear? What? <laughs> what is happening in my chat? You guys are weird. Okay, pill? Oh! Harley Charker, thank you for the resub. For three months in a row. Our baby is born for three months? Oh, for nine months total, I gotcha. Well, thank you very much and welcome. The flies are mine. I guess Beelzebub is the synergy that makes all flies friendly. That's good, I, I think. A bomb and a key. Give me a bomb just so we're even. Oh, right, be careful of the mushrooms. Actually, should we open up all the mushrooms? We should look for like pills and whatnot. They could explode on us, but. So far, so good, I guess. And Cabbage Box is welcome to the stream as well. Long time no see. I hope you're doing you're doing well. I have to remember I can fly, so it's actually easy for me to walk into the mushrooms. You just fly over them, forehead. I need to be guppy at some point. Okay, bomb. 
HP. I will go to the uh, secret room, we'll check it out. This, that's not gonna be the secret room, I don't know why I put a bomb there. Just in my head I'm like, yes, look, look in all the places. Dun, 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 dun. If we get a planetarium, then this uh, telescope will be worth it. We actually do have like okay damage now. It's not like direct damage, but because we spawn flies and spiders out of our tears, we're happy because we have, um, oh, it's so glitchy. Because we have um, the flies, we're kind of happy. Luck up makes more flies. I'm kind of just hopeful to pick up like HP at this point because I'm, I'm being silly and I'm getting hurt in the process. I'm just waiting for my flies to explode too. They haven't exploded yet, surprisingly. Dreamcatcher, those are my flies now? Dreamcatcher is at least half of a spirit heart every floor? But I'm still gonna re-roll it because it doesn't really matter if it is... Yeah, I'm gonna take this. If it is half a spirit heart every floor, I'd rather have something better. And now I'm thinking with, uh, with this is that we can get pennies out of killing enemies with contact damage, so we might be able to get more consumables out of the... Uh, out of the item, the, uh, the the golden bar. Golden bar. Don't pick up the bombs, you idiot. Oh, don't pick up the pennies either. I'm gonna go explore the rest of the floor. We need, we need more consumables on the ground. We need so much more. Jeannie's asking about what you're looking for. You always look for specific items or something. All right, what I'm looking for on, on the recipes is one, an easy source of health. So an HP upgrade. I am so dumb. I thought I was invincible for some reason. Okay, one more time. No, you know what? Let's do one more, because <laughs> why not? Because I keep dying in stupid fashions. Um, so, I, I'm, I'm always looking for easy sources of HP, which we didn't have a recipe for that, so I was a little bit low on health. I'm looking for anything that gives me damage. So on that last run we had flies and generating flies and spiders. And then after that it's just whatever you have that's good and can give you synergies. So, we, we need I needed to find some sort of a recipe that gave me health and we couldn't find it, so I, I hadn't I mean, I had four HP. I, I'm trying to remember what gave us the health. It was um, a random meat upgrade, which I think was due to an eternal heart, and then I forget what the other item was, because I don't remember how we had four HP, honestly. Um, but yeah, at least the, uh, the meat was not an easy recipe for us. But if we can get easy recipes for HP, we can get like six, eight, nine, 10, 12 heart containers early, and then we can, you know, live through the dumb damage like that. And the recipes are changing because this is post-update, and post-update the recipes all change. So, here's what we're gonna do. One, two, three, four, five, six, two bombs. Gives us the box, which is interesting because it's a little bit of everything. What is one bomb? The bean. So I tell you what, I, I am actually gonna take the bean. It gives me some damage early. It's not it's not good, it's not a lot, but it's something. You could have filled your heart containers. So I mean that's just because I freaking uh took I took a lot of damage trying to get pills out of the mushrooms, which is stupid. I, I'm I'm going far too aggressively on Tainted Cane. I gotta be playing a little bit more conservatively, I'm realizing. We need to be conservative with our health so that we can survive bad hits and dumbness and damage. Okay, this spider is starting to piss me off. Oh, there we go. 
So we have a bean. Well, we're not gonna repeat that recipe because you don't need more than one of them, but that's one black bomb and seven pennies gives us a bean. Two bombs gave us, uh, I forgot what it was. It was something, something not important. <laughs> Whatever it was. Um, dude, if I get one bomb, I can go in there and get all those consumables from the opening room. Right, the box, thank you. I guess if, if we need a consumable or something, we can always get it out of the box, like if we need a key, or if we need a bomb, or if we need HP. You know, so I guess there is a way that you can use the box on this run, if you ever, you got six cents and two bombs. But for now, let's just keep dumping everything we have into the sack. Also, let's try to remember to use the fart attack. You know what, I'll, I'll accept picking up the HP. We need the health. But yeah, I remember um, in particular, before they, they changed how this character worked, there was a couple of really easy health recipes and it was just like three red hearts, four red hearts. It was hard not to find health on, on the, the base recipes, but since everything's random, sometimes it takes a while, it's hard to get. These guys didn't shoot, they just spawned flies the whole time. And there's another bomb that we can't access. Bean, dare I say, helping out. If we get just a couple of more pennies, we can get a sweet recipe. Hello, spider, my old friend. The heck is this torn pocket, a hole in your pocket? If we get hit, we drop money or something? Honestly, like, I, I guess we'll take it just to see what it does, but I don't think it's any good at all. We'll see, we'll see. Keep a bomb, I gotta find a bomb and make sure to remember not to put it in the bag. That's the big problem, I keep putting it in the bag. Not all bombs need to go in bags, you need to save like at least one and one key. Right. Well, that's not exactly what I had in mind. So, let's put a garbage heart and a red heart. Irritable bowel syndrome, no. Curse of the tower, no. I do not want these items. We have no items on this floor, by the way. Just pointing that out. A rune, Hagalaz. You know, um, let's use it in here. I know we could put it in the bag, but I want to see what this is. What this will give us? No, let's use it on this room, so we can get the bomb, so that we can go up there to get the other consumables, so that we can get the chest. Okay, so hold on. Take take the bomb. What blew up? You come up here. I mean, we could blow up the donation machine too, which would be amusing. But we should have used Hagalaz up here. Yeah, I'm dumb. This would have been a way better Hagalaz room. Then put you in. Then put you in. Okay, fire mind. Let's take it. I'm never gonna remember the recipe, but one is fine. So our shots will explode now, but so will the enemies. I don't think this will work. I think it's gotta be an enemy or like a fire. I don't think you can just command your shots to explode on command, unfortunately. Let's go down to the next floor. I'm also gonna like move myself a little bit on my desk. There we go, now I'm centered on the microphone. Actually, can you even explode on fires? Torn Pocket seems useful. If you pick something up accidentally, you'll drop it. I think you only drop money with Torn Pocket. I don't think you actually drop anything else. I guess we had the bean. We have two items. You know what? The fire damage is not much, 
but it's honest work. Hello, did not expect to fight a boss. But we have half of a spirit heart, which means that we have a deal with the devil. Harley Charkas says, my Isaac save got corrupted, now I'm just watching streams. Good opportunity to replay the game from scratch, honestly. Oh, you hate watching Isaac streams. Oh, okay. That's why you should play the game from scratch and get caught up. <laughs> um, so one bomb and two bombs, we know what that gives us. What about a... I mean, let's do a key bomb and a red heart. We did that previously and it worked out well. Mom's bottle of pills. Okay, what about two bombs? Stopwatch, what about four bombs? Speed and range up. Four bombs a heart and a key. Four bombs, a heart and a key. If we can get four bombs, a heart and a key, then we can get spun. So that's what we should be working forward, uh, working towards here. I remember this room. We need to get as many syringes now. Because that means damage. So we have damage available. Four bombs, a heart and a key. Okay, golden bomb, not so much. Ugh, run. That's not the right button, that is. Okay, let's not go into the curse room and get ourselves killed immediately, shall we? Hi guys, ooh, I got one of them. I guess they immediately de once I ran out of charges, huh? At least there's only like five spiders instead of 12. Okay, money. We have a nickel in our bag right now, so I don't really know what kind of a recipe we're gonna be looking for here. Anything good. Whoops, wrong button. Jump! Let's see what we get. If there's red hearts, well now if there's red hearts, I'll probably definitely go to that curse room. It's actually an insane amount of money. Ludo? Two nickels and a dime is Ludo? Sure. Now we have one giant flaming tear. You know, at least this is an interesting start, you know? I don't think our shot um, explodes and disappears anymore. I think that used to be a, a, a problem with Ludo. Oh, we can't even go to the alt floor. Who cares? <laughs> Let's just like have a good run. Go to the chest and try to win one. Our, our victory streak is like negative 10 right now. No, thank you. Yeah, I don't I don't think Ludo Firemind is bad anymore. Cause previously it would explode and your tear would disappear. What? Yes! Okay, the, what? No. Eve's mascara is, is horrible, right? I mean I gotta try it. It's so slow. And yet oh so good. Please help. There's a fly. A single fly. Here, let's, let's do a race, Isaac race, go! Wow, we are, th I mean, you know, the, the math doesn't lie. The tier is uh, almost a third as slow as we are. But it does pack a punch, it does pack a punch. Architrax says we're doomed. We're not doomed, you're doomed. Wait a minute, I can push my tier? Epic Tainted Cane Strategies. You push your tear to give it a little bit of a shove. <laughs> well, at least this is uh, consumables. Not much though. Come into my tier. At least we don't have bad damage, you know? If we had bad damage, this would be a lot worse. As it is, it's just slow. <laughs> it's just a slow, giant moving tier. 
Also, I'm, I, what I really should be doing is I should be doing the thing I was talking about, trying to find cheap recipes. Instead, I'm just putting everything I can into my bag. We need to save stuff and then try to turn, you know, pennies and red hearts into HP upgrades, which I'm not doing, but I should be. So let's stop picking up everything. Four bombs, a heart, and a key. Well, the syringe, the uh, green syringe, does not actually give us uh, a shot speed increase. It only gives us a range up, so that's not what we're looking for. Do we want the compass? Not really. It's, it's not shot speed up or damage or tears or HP, so I think we're just gonna reroll this item as soon as we get to this worm. Boomerang, no thank you. I, I gotta say, I'm actually kinda happy with the bean. I can kill anything that's fast. And our tier can kill all the things that are slow. So let's let's move on here. Keep trying to find the the mystical HP upgrade that should exist in this run somewhere. Temperance. I, I don't I don't think we want temperance. I think I just wanna Put it in the bag. BFF, okay, well, you know, it is damage. It's also gonna get me killed. You son of a... I know I should have gone for you first. In the moment, though, I was very uh, worried about that spider. D20. We, we don't really care about a D20, do we? Consumables are consumables. Yeah, I, I guess I could re-roll them, but I kind of want the bean right now. Got him. <laughs> I, was, I was just barely fast enough. All right, polycephalus. Again, at least our damage is good. Please. 9% angel chance. We got a 9% angel chance. We, what? We also have an insane number of good items on the ground? Okay, well, let's start by um, going in here. I want it. And then let's put this in the bag. Glyph of balance, we don't care. Swap this. Fetus? We can do better. That's a lucky penny. HP up in flight? Yes, please. Now, it's a bit of an expensive recipe. Goes against the idea that I was talking about earlier, but that's fine. We'll, we'll get better recipes. We'll find them. <laughs> Just, you know, had to. Wah, wah, wah. Who, who, who said the angels were hard to fight? They're easy. Okay, you went through the pillar. That's rude. Oop. All right. Well, there's your uh, first keepies. Now. Big bombs. Let's try again. Let's try again. Fat odd mushroom I'm gonna take, because it's HP up. Speed down, but we have plenty of speed. We've gotta try to build up a surplus of health, so anything that's giving me health right now, I'm, I'm basically gonna take. And any if I can find something that gives us shot speed, I'm also gonna take it. But that is tough to find. Engaging gameplay against the heart. Hey, you know what? If it works, it works. It's so, <laughs> it's so slow. Oh God. 
I'm gonna go to the cursor and we have enough health to survive it now. Okay. I mean, this is a, definitely an interesting run. And, you know, we're trying to make something happen here. We just gotta, just gotta push it a little bit more. Find some good freaking recipes. Next floor, I'm gonna, I'm gonna tell you what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna try to leave everything on the ground and only pick it up at the very end. I want, I want seven pennies, one red heart, and I wanna see what it makes. Cause we got, we gotta find a recipe. A cheap, easy, easily to reproduce recipe that gives us some, something good, something great. Even stem cells, like stem cells would be probably one of the best things we could get because it would give us a, um, a shot speed up. I would love that. So I, I am just gonna put the penny in the bag because that's, that's what I'm looking for. I'm looking for pennies. Pills we can wait on. It's gonna be hard to remember to go back for everything with no map, but we'll try. Wait, just wait for the bullet. At least Ludo keeps us like really safe. Let me pick up the key here. Thank you. Please stop, thank you. At least we're still fast enough to get away from bombs. More pennies. Which is what I want. Speedball would be good. We do have the one syringe and I do want more syringes. So yeah, speedball, I would uh, love to be able to find. They were not close enough, huh? You know, we'll, we'll work on it. Did I not have a key two seconds ago? What happened? I did I put? I didn't put it in the bag. Where did my key go? <laughs> I feel like I'm playing a board game and someone just cheated on me by pocketing money that met, was meant for the banker. Like, did I not just have a key? That's a lucky penny, so let's leave it on the ground for now. Torn pocket? Oh, I. Torn pocket, pocket lets you drop consumables and I dropped it inside of the curse room, is what you're saying. Dude, we gotta dump this torn pocket. That is, that is not good. <laughs> like, I could see if you get like the quarter, because you could just drop 25 pennies on the ground, but they might be dimes and nickels. Well, I mean, those would be good. It would just take freaking forever. I can't be leaving keys behind just because I took a hit on a curse room. I love that that deflects projectiles now. At least him being so slow means I have an opportunity to move my tier. I guess I just never knew what Torn Pocket did. Hey, I hit him once, one tick of damage. On. Got him! Well, there is HP, not what I'm looking for though. Okay. Telepathy for dummies, actually not that bad. With the Ludo tier, but let's see what we get out of two red hearts. More curse rooms. What about two red hearts and a key? Pickaxe, what about two red hearts, a key, and a bomb? Coupon, what about a key, a bomb, and a red heart? Mom's bottle of pills, yet again. Okay, so we need something else in this recipe. Two bombs. Broken stopwatch. Dude, these recipes are not giving me what I'm looking for. Two bombs, two keys, and a red heart. The scooper. I'm tempted to pick up the penny there, but TNT, I mean, I guess that is five bombs, but I lose my active item. Dude, these recipes are horrible. What happened? Did I go over here? I did, I still need the key. Oh, I, I keep putting keys in the bag. Oh, I'm stupid. 
Let me let me see if I can grab this key. Go into the item room, at least get some items on the ground. Put your items on the ground. Hey, lots of keys. Okay, three keys, three red hearts, two bombs. Bombs coin purse. Three keys, three bombs. St okay, it's stem cells. Two hearts, three keys, three bombs. We've done it. P point oh six. Point oh six. Pardon, hua. Point zero six tears. What? <laughs> But at least at least we have an HP recipe and it's not that expensive. We might have we might be able to find a cheaper one, but that's good enough for now. 3 bombs, 3 keys, 2 red hearts is HP. And it is also a small tier uh not tiers up, but a small shot speed up with our big tier. So if we stack up like 4 or 5 of those, we'll be happy with our tier rate. Happier, I guess. I guess I'm already happier cuz it's a 10% up. Not only is this a slow run, we are also just slow. You know what? We gotta look for it. We gotta look for pennies. Every penny is important. We have eight items. Shot speed is killing me to watch. Dude, it's killing me to play. Red stew. Oh man, if only we had the other item that's good with red stew. This is glass shard. Oh, that's so horrible. <laughs> it's like watching paint dry is what this is. It's so slow. Oh my god. What, 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 what did it? Oh, Eve's mascara. I guess I did do it to myself, essentially. I have no one to blame. Compass. I, I still don't think we want the compass. I, I think we want something a little bit better. I don't want potato peeler. So, I think we're out. Yeah, at least we have really good damage. You're close to 3-3-2. Three, three, yeah, but... I know I, it's tough because in my head I'm always like, ooh, you know, we're really close to some sort of an upgrade, but in, in my head I'm also like, we need something else. At least that's a tears up. You know, we need to search the item pools to find like some good item that we can utilize. So that's kind of what I'm trying to do here right now. I'm like, okay, let's search the item pools, put stuff in the bag, see what we get. And maybe on this floor we'll get like one HP upgrade. Maybe we'll try to do one. One and one. One random item that we, we get, one HP upgrade. So there's two keys, and there is a whole bunch of money down here. So we are in the we are in the making, in the drawing for a don't, don't. Possibly, oh man, he was pushing my tier. Possibly cheap item. But let's keep doing the rooms and, and dropping the consumables so we can use them later. Including you. Man, thank God the tier doesn't explode. I'm actually just gonna pick that up. Even though we do need it for uh, the HP recipe. We'll, we'll, I'm. I'm sure we'll get more HP, but I want to keep that bone heart alive for the deal with the angel chance. Deal with the angel is a big one. If we can get a good angel deal, something that makes the tier decent, I'll be so happy. You know, if, you know, if we can get like a godhead or something, that'd be great. Yeah, at least our tier it does kill things very quickly. Okay, so let's do the boss fight, see what happens. It's death. Not exactly the boss we want to be fighting with this tier, but 
You know, when he chases us, oh god, when he chases us down, he's gonna be so fast. Yo, break the tinted rock. I thought you dropped bombs when you did this. Do you not, do you not do that anymore? I guess you don't do that anymore. Well, this is one way of doing it. He's got a very veiny head. He also looks awesome when he's on fire. Okay, three keys, three bombs, two red hearts. If we find two red hearts, we have enough for stem cells, and then we have a lot of just random things on the ground on the floor. HP? We have so much money. <laughs> I don't wanna go to the, uh, to the shop. What I want to do is I wanna pick up all the dimes and nickels and make a good item. Okay, HP, go in the bag. I guess we should have waited, but. If we get one more HP, we have a tears up. Or, I keep calling it a tears up. The shot speed up, excuse me, streamer. Get your items right. Is that another nickel? I don't know what we're gonna make on this floor, but it's gonna be good. At least I hope. Considering we have nine items, this run is not that bad. I mean, we, we know because of Tainted Isaac that you can have a good run with few items. Which is good, because it's what, we're, what we have. I mean, I love getting the keys, but you know, one Heart would go a long way right about now. Okay, that was very quick on the right side envy. I keep thinking that the fire trail is gonna do damage, it doesn't. There's our other HP, okay. So we're gonna get an HP upgrade right here. Um, all the bombs are on this side of the map, so let's go this way. Okay, yoink, there's a key here. One more key, two more bombs. Bomb, 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 bomb. Hey, does Ludo stack? Because if Ludo stacks somehow, it might be worth making another Ludo. But I kind of don't want to waste the items making another Ludo. Is our HP? 0.16 tiers up. There you go. Ludo stacks giving you another tiny orb of a uh, tier orbiting your current tier. Well, maybe we can make Ludo. I kind of forgot what was the Ludo recipe, but I guess in theory we could, you know, try to recreate it. But let's go for a money recipe right now and see what we get. Let's make one fantastic item. We have so much money on the ground. Dimes and nickels. You know what, give me two pennies. Papula duplex, wide tears, okay. Interesting, I don't think it's necessarily that good. PhD for better pills. I feel like this is a bit of a waste because we have so many good consumables in our bag. You can get PhD on the cheap with other recipes. Let's replace the pennies and see what we can get out of this. Like, a key. Uh, I'm not gonna come back into the room. But that's unfortunate because um, it's an expensive tiers upgrade and we don't really need it. Let's try another key. Forget me now. Bit of a waste. What about... Uh, let's put a bomb in the bag? No, put a pill in the bag. It's a damage up, but it makes more champions spawn, but it's a damage up, but it's also just not that good. This is a, a fly item. We know that we can get, you know, good fly synergies, but I don't think it's what we want. I'm going back for the bomb now. 
Okay, uh, no lucky pennies. Sackhead actually could be amazing, but... I have to know. Emo Lacry, I'm seeing red. It completely ruins Ludo. I hate this item. He Hemolacria sucks. I, I, I'm, I have to remember what this item is and never pick it up again because it just ruins so many synergies. I hate it. Why? Oh my god. <laughs> Why do I keep taking Hemolacria? <laughs> we fire a tear, but to what end? I mean, I guess we do have 20 damage. Was that because of Hemolacria? Did it give us 20 damage? Excuse me? All right, I mean, I guess if we have 20 damage, it can't be that bad. But it's not a very good item. Because <laughs> it, I just, I, I just don't like that it ruins synergies. Give me, where's my synergy? Its damage boost is pretty dope though. Um, let's see, joystick, controllable tiers. Uh, what about one key? Monster Manuel. I guess we're done with the floor. I, I don't know, is, is, this, is this good enough? Hemolacry is awesome except for losing synergies, but that's like the big negative of it. Like I want synergies, that's why I play Isaac. Damage is fine, but where's my Ludo? I was having a fun time trying to figure out how to, you know, build a, a run that I could, you know, feel proud of. With shot speed and everything. I don't, these, I feel like these shots are gonna burn me. Okay. What, what, what is the card? Moon. This is extremely good. I can fly. It didn't give us anything, or it didn't give us much. Spider Rock is pretty interesting, but I wanna see what happens if we put a bomb in here too. Mom's bottle of pills, that's right. Okay, well, you know what? I guess we'll take Spider Rock. Oh, you jerk. We need red hearts. I don't know, the damage is, it's all right. It seems like we have some sort of spectral shots, which is making uh, Hemolacria not explode on impact, but maybe it never did. I don't know. I gotta stop taking this item. You know, I, I, I don't know. It, it, it's at least doing something. It feels okay. It could feel worse, let's say. Um, I would still like a shot speed upgrade because this thing is so damn slow. It takes a million years to hit its target. I just walked into a rock and lost my bone heart, so that's fun. Stop jumping. But to lose Ludo, to have, you know, okay damage, but not great damage, I don't know. Flew into the rock? Excuse me, you're right. I did fl fly into the rock, not jump into the rock or run into the rock. I guess the idea is that you wanna you wanna direct impact with the tier so you get all the additional bullets hitting the same target. That's what you wanna do with this thing. I guess we'll just leave everything on the ground still. This is the depths freaking too. Strength. Put you in the bag. I don't know why I decided to put that in the bag immediately. I should have just waited. You know what? Screw it. We're putting stuff in the bag immediately. <laughs> um, that's a lucky penny, so you get in the bag. I don't know what this is. Tears up? Piercing shots plus speed up. I thought it was a tears upgrade. I always get them mixed up. But still, it's not bad. 
I will uh, you know, definitely appreciate it tears up when we have to maneuver so carefully in order to land our shots. Piercing tears, you know, I guess we kind of already had that, huh? Is this just a fun run or a special unlock run? This is just a fun run, I'm just playing the game. I guess if you, you could say that I'm trying to go for a special unlock, I'm trying to do, um, well, everything. Dead God, is if that's what it is, I gotta find every item in the game. Still haven't found every item. Need to find death certificate and like, stopwatch, strangely enough. Otherwise, yeah, it's just a fun run. I keep running into like every bullet. I'm, I'm not paying attention with the dodging. Playing as Tainted Kane is, is it's kind of getting to me a little bit. <laughs> I'm starting to feel it deep in my soul. I don't, I don't, oh dude, we're almost to another HP upgrade. We just need one key. So let's go get that right now. It, it's starting to hurt my soul a little bit playing this, but We'll make do. 0.16 shot speed. Why was the first one 0.06? That's the thing that doesn't make sense to me. Money? Let's go to the curse room. We already lost our bone heart. Okay, Anarchist Cookbook and Tarot Deck. Fantastic. Exactly what I wanted. <laughs> 0 0.6 plus 10. Well, it's like the first one only gave me the 0 0.6, which I think is kind of funny. The bonus we're getting seems to be slightly going up. That's, that's the whole floor, that's it. We've sucked up every consumable on the entire floor. Did we even get any items? What happened on this floor? At least our bullet hits the wall and immediately explodes. So thank thankfully that works. That was a horrible floor. We got a, a, a speed up and one more stack of stem cells. Okay. Give me a rotten heart. Key bum. Screw you, key bum. Weird spikes. Brittle bones, which is a tears up. No, it's just bone tears, which don't even work with hemolacria. <laughs> if we had Ludo, it would actually work. We would have bone tears right now that would split and parasite effect. Dude, Hemolacria is awful. It doesn't seem to work with anything. Box. Yeah, damn you, Hemolacria! I, I just want a synergy to work with it. Oh good, it's still the box when we add a card to it. Homing shots. The jar, I guess the jar would not be that bad. We have very good damage. Mom's coin purse, if we just wanted to put a whole bunch of, oh, oh, the consumable world. Tech baby. I didn't mean to pick up the key, that's fine. Glitchiness. I need more consumables. I need other consumables. I need to. I need a, a variety of consumables, please. I mean, shots wouldn't have been bad. Yeah, but I, I still like the bean. I still like holding onto that bean right about now. BFF doesn't work with flies and spiders. At least our damage is not bad. <laughs> It might not be the most interesting item, but at least it's not horrible. And ne now with 9 volt, I would take homing shots. Every room to have homing shots, I would do it. Absolutely. Oh my god. You know what? I'm taking the box. Put a bunch of stuff on the ground.
I guess that counts as a rune. There you go. I, I hate just seeing like a whole bunch of bombs and pennies on the ground. Give me some other consumables, please. Compound fracture seems to be working. Uh, I don't. I don't see it. You know, may, maybe when we hit an enemy with a direct shot, it is splitting. But like, it's most of the value is still lost from uh, from it. I feel. But maybe, uh, maybe a direct shot is a little bit more worthwhile. Oops. Okay. You know. Let's see what we get. Number two. All right, well. Candy heart. So we get stats when we pick up hearts. Gimpy. Gimpy is probably worth it because it'll put a lot of HP on the ground. So we'll take Gimpy on that one. Is that item a bloody tampon? It is E. coli, turdy touch. When you touch enemies, they turn into boop. Things are just exploding. I think I'm understanding why things explode, by the way. If our tier hits an enemy directly, the, the split tiers can explode from it. That seems to be what's going on with it. Right, I forgot that you fire homing shots. I hate this enemy so much. <laughs> He's a piece of garbage. Money bag would give us more money, but we're pretty close to the end of the of the path we've chosen for ourselves. Hello. Luckfoot. Honestly, give me Luckfoot. You never know when you're gonna find some pills and now we can actually take them. Because I've been neglecting our pills recently. And it seems like if the primary tier explodes, the, the secondary tiers will explode. Because we're, we're getting all or nothing on the explosions. We've gone through the past two floors very quickly. Yeah, that was Penny Bag. I, th I think it was Penny Bag. Maybe it was Bomb Bag? No, I thought it was Penny Bag. Whatever, whatever bag it was, I think it's just a little bit too late for it. Yeah, at least our... Uh at least our fire and poison damage is, is pretty decent. And our like raw damage, even though we do fire incredibly slowly. I also need to pick up a whole bunch of keys, I'm realizing, because this is the uh, the chest coming up. So many explosions. Hello. Oh dude! I just realized self-sacrifice rooms. If you get the seven spirit heart payout, it's incredible, isn't it? I hate that sound. If we get like a whole bunch of red hearts on the ground, we should absolutely go for that. The heck, is that like broken heart or something? Well. Just blew myself up, <laughs> as expected. Um, range and luck up. I don't feel like range is what we want. Shots. That's not my fire. Shot speed is the important one. I just need to pick up the HP, actually, if we find some. Because we are hurting. The jar flies still. Oh my god. Battery charges? This is one of the negatives of having randomized recipes. Yeah, it makes for a more interesting uh, 
like set of decisions about what items you take and you gotta search for recipes, but you gotta search for recipes, you know? It's tough. The screw. We've done it. It's a tears up. What is one nickel? We we've never seen one nickel. Farting baby. What about two nickels? Have we seen two nickels? The magnet. Okay, I'm, you know, was kind of expecting something maybe a little bit better than the magnet, but uh, is there anything else in the ground? I don't think we really left anything behind. At least F spiders. You know what? Jesus juice. I'll take it. A little bit of damage. 0 0.8 tears up. Yeah, it is a very, very minor tears up, huh? Dude, at least I have spiders, but we're doing no damage to Isaac because our shots just don't land properly. Actually, our damage is now okay. Now that, he, now that he's not in the middle of the room and we can actually hit him, like directly with the bullet, seems a lot better, especially when it explodes. Okay, well, we made it to the chest. Finally, <laughs> three runs into the Isaac run. Okay. What is one red heart? Well, that's not one red heart, but I'll take it. You're a sticky nickel? Let's take you. Halo, way too late. Holy, holy poop? You want holy poop on this one? To have homing shots if we ever take damage does seem okay. What what kind of a shot was that? Excuse me? Wow, could you guys please die? Why are they so tanky? <laughs> Why are we doing so little damage? I hate not being able to see my HP on this because I don't know when I need to like really, 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 you know, hunker down and stop getting hit on everything. Which really should be at all times, but. <sighs> he almost hit me with that spider. I would have been annoyed. Like that shot, I shot the wall in front of me so the shots would bounce behind me. <laughs> it's, it's actually working. We get a little bit of like a spread shot. And if our shot hits two walls, it does like a double bounce. Look, everything is going in the bag at this point, okay? I can't be affording to, you know, take one black heart on the off chance it keeps us alive. Thanks, thanks, thanks. I did kind of walk into that enemy though. Sure, I'm gonna take Whore of Babylon in case we need it. <laughs> why, why not just, you know, take the HP instead of take, you know, getting a item that's almost worthless? Yeah, that's a good point, you know? I haven't thought about that. There you go, there's a lot of HP, we're fine. Oh good, I blew myself up. <laughs> I should have really put those into the bag and I should go back and open the chest too. Although it's not like we're gonna get items out of the chest. We gotta get enough consumables on the ground that we can put items in the bag. How did that not hit me? Honestly, I should, I should stop being dumb. I should just 
take the HP. Because we're gonna effing need it. What? I've never seen this before. I already have that item. Okay, now our stats are almost base level. I don't know. <laughs> I don't. I don't know how I feel about this. How sh how should I feel about this? up oh constellation prize give me range up I should have done it in a different order well there's no way I could have done it in a different order but all right well this is gonna be interesting oh, I really wish I could keep that still five damage six <laughs> yeah three rate of fire six damage only a little bit better than your starting stats at this point. Sure, give me uh, give me blood clot. It's something. Oh, the shots are going backwards. I'm just I'm just mostly worried about the random explosions that are going to get me killed. That's the big thing. Although, when the explosions don't hurt myself, we seem to be doing pretty well. Oh, God. Dude, money! Money, 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 money. Old bandage, thank you very much for the HP capacity. We're at full health. Well, I think just off of the raw HP that we have, we should be fine. Here's hoping anyways. That was dumb damage. Basically, I have no control over where my tears go at this point. I'm just firing into the wild blue yonder, hoping that they uh, reach their destination. Still at full health. If we have full health, I'm just taking it. That was stupid. Dude, Tainted Cane, really hard now. <laughs> now that you don't have access to uh, specific recipes and you have to search for them, actually kind of tough. Oh, shot speed, thank you. At full health, put it in the bag. If we have full health, stuff goes in the bag. Please, just give me some more items. I don't even want the items for the items, I just want the consumables to give myself more items. Please, please! Oh, you son of a gun. No, you do not get to live. Give me my HP back. Goodness, where, okay, I was gonna say, where the heck is this boss? Thank you, Gimpy. P please, Gimpy, help, help me. <laughs> Lodestone? Yeah, why not, let's do it. This'll be funny. Because if, if we hit with Lodestone, all of our tears, tears will magnetize the blue baby. Not can't help but notice it hasn't happened yet. Guess it is kind of hard to hit. Okay! Um, that was the poop. <laughs> Do my fires block enemy bullets? I have no idea. Well, a little bit chaotic. 
but we finally won as Tainted Kane. I, it, you know, I think I gotta figure out some strategy for Tainted Kane that, that um, maybe goes through more item recipes faster because the early game is so slow. Ironically enough, because we had the slow moving, uh, you know, bullet on this run, but it's so slow when you are are trying to find recipes. And previously, there were always fallbacks. Um, one bomb and seven pennies used to give you the finger, which is always stackable and at least some damage that scales because every finger makes your fingers stronger. So that was always a fallback recipe that if you had nothing else, you can at least get fingers. But um, but yeah, not having access to any sustainable recipe is is, is hard. So I guess I'm I guess I'm leaning towards maybe in the beginning of the run, save every consumable, go for like seven pennies, one red heart, and then just try to find easy, simple recipes. Because we really needed some easy, simple recipes. And at least on this run, I feel like there were no good, easy, simple recipes. But it sucks. <laughs> Anyways, for those of you on YouTube, thank you very much for watching. Like the video if you've enjoyed it, subscribe for more. Check me out on Twitch for when I go live. Support me on Twitch, Patreon, and Streamlabs, and I hope to see you here again for the next run of The Binding of Isaac Repentance.